In this video, we are going to look at an example where we can apply Graham's law. And the question says nitrogen gas diffuses 1.25 times faster than gas X. Calculate the relative molecular mass of gas X. Usually with such questions, once you obtain the molecular mass, you can have an idea on the nature of the gas. So since we don't know the rate of diffusion of gas X, we can let it be Y. We can say let the rate of diffusion of gas of our gas X diffusion of gas X be Y and that means the rate of diffusion of our nitrogen will be two times faster than that of X so this will be 1.25 Y so that's the rate of diffusion of nitrogen but we know that according to Graham's law the rate of diffusion of any gas rate of diffusion of a gas is inversely proportional to the square root of its molecular mass where our capital M is our molecular mass so that means if we have two gases we shall find that the rate of diffusion of nitrogen rate of diffusion of our nitrogen divide by allow me abbreviate the rate of diffusion of our gas X will be equal to the square root of the molecular mass of X divided by the molecular mass of nitrogen remember it's inversely proportional rate of diffusion is inversely proportional that's why you see that molecular mass of nitrogen is below that of X so that will mean that the rate of diffusion of nitrogen will be 1.25 y divided by that of X which is y being equal to molecular mass of X that's what we want to find mx divide by molecular mass of nitrogen so we know that nitrogen has actual atomic number atomic mass of 14 that means nitrogen gas will be 14 times 2 which is equal to 28 so this is the molecular mass of nitrogen so this is 28 with our square root so if we have to square both sides to remove the square root our y's will cancel so we shall be left with this will imply that 1.25 squared will be equal to molecular mass of x over 28 and that gives us molecular mass of x being equal to 1.25 squared times 28 so 1.25 squared times 28 is 43 0.75 which is roughly 44 so the molecular mass of gas X will be 44 grams all coming from our Graham's law that deals with rate of diffusion in relation to molecular mass